What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Dirky Chan. Today, I'm going to do a review of one of my summer staples, my Uniqlo Arism Polos right here. I have three of them, and these are some of the most worn polos. I wear these to work a lot. I got one in heather gray, navy blue, and black. And these I've had about, I would say, five years. I got these back in 2019. And they're still looking good. I, I pretty much wore them on a bi-weekly basis during the summer. I would switch between polo shirts and short sleeve button-ups to go to the office. And over time, I washed these machine cold, hang dry, and, an, and I didn't have any issues. I'm 5'8", 180 pounds, and I got all of these in small. Now... I was in between a small and a medium, and I went with the small because I wanted a more fitted look because I'll be wearing this to work uh, with some chinos and some dress shoes. So I went with the small. And you'll see later on in the try-on video that these do fit pretty well to my body, and they show off uh, not a lot of uh, loose fabric. So these are great if you want a nice, simple, clean look. And these won't bake, break the bank. Back in 2019, I think I cop each one of these for like 20 or 30 bucks. They're $30 now, which is kind of expensive. But looking back, these do last you quite a long time. So 30 bucks for a basic summer daily item pans out pretty well. I'm going to go over some of the wear and tear over five years and then uh, do the on fit. So I'm showing you the neck collar. So over time, this neck collar gets a bit grimy because you're gonna be wearing this in the summer. So it's gonna be brushing up your neck a lot of the times. And as you can see, over time, it gets a bit worn out, this uh, neck liner part. But then again, this is me being very nitpicky. As you can see in the gray, the neck seam is pilling and it's slowly deteriorating over time but again it's very nitpicky buttons they have remained intact some loose threads here and there that you gotta chip off and cut away over time check the navy pair these darker buttons are less noticeable with the loose threads but i haven't had any issues with the buttons popping out in my five years of wearing this the collar remains pretty flat. I didn't get any curling of the collar whatsoever. That's one of my biggest pet peeves with polos is the curling of it. I'll do a comparison video of these Uniqlo polos with uh, Ralph Lauren polos and show you the differences in the collars and, and the quality. So yeah, no issues with the collar. The collar remains flat. And you check on my black one. Again, remains flat. So yeah, I love the collars on these. They always remain nice and flat. The sleeves, this part can be a bit tight depending on how muscular you are, but these do stretch out a bit over time. But I haven't had any issues with these sleeves breaking on me. No holes in the armpit. Again, I wash cold, hang dry. Very simple. But yeah, in terms of color preservation, the black, Still looks pretty dark to me. Again, this is a five-year-old polo, and the colors are still there. They're not fading whatsoever. I've had some other polos that after one wash, the color fades drastically, so I don't really wear those anymore. But yeah, other than that, I mean, there's not much to say besides positive things with these polos. I've worn them for five years. They've held up. Nothing has broken. No threads have come out. Maybe just the buttons has some loose threads. But other than that, not a lot of wear and tear. I mean, there's no stains on this polo, on this heather gray color. Usually there's stains on these lighter colors, but there's nothing, nothing wrong. So I guess all that's left to do is to throw them on. These are a great, great purchase for 30 bucks. And they feel great on skin. Very breathable on a hot summer day. Very nice. Now, when you first buy them, they can be a bit rough to the skin. 
but as you wash it, it will soften up over time. That's all I have, guys. On fit, ciao. All right, here's the black polo on fit. <clears throat> I have some Lululemon ABC joggers. These two go very well. A nice black Airs and Polo. As you can see, this is a small. I'm 5'8", 180 pounds. And the sleeves are tight, but, but still comfortable. Again, I was in between a small and a medium. Medium was a bit looser, but I went with a small because I wanted a more fitted look. And this is how it looks. Definitely, definitely fitted, but not uncomfortable. I could still move around, move my arms, whatnot. No issues, I can lift my arms up and it won't show any belly button. Now you're gonna feel a small bit of tightness around the chest and that's just because I went with a small, I'm usually a medium, I wanted a fitted look. So it's kind of expected. But this, this fabric still stretches with you. So I wouldn't worry too much about it being constricting. I still feel very comfortable. But yeah, this is the polo in black. Looking good, I love these collars. They don't curl up a lot, unlike my other polos. So I absolutely love this for 30 bucks. Super breathable, has this nice softer fabric on the inside. Absolutely amazing. All right, on to the next color. All right, next up is the Heather Gray. I have it tucked in to my ABC joggers and the shirt ends a bit below my waistband. So if I lift my arms up, the shirt will not come out. So that's always great for when you have a tucked in polo. Now, definitely do not dry these, they will shrink. I have a gray polo that I accidentally dried and it definitely shrunk to an extra small. So do not dry these, hang dry them, machine wash code if you wanna preserve the shape. Now I absolutely love tucking in this polo. It looks so good because it's very, very fitted. Again, I'm 5'8", 180 pounds. And this is how the polo looks. Bam! Bam! Hey! But yeah, great, great polo, size small. And another thing I like about these polos is that they don't really wrinkle that much. So you don't have to spend too much time ironing them. You just wash them, hang dry them, and 90% of the time, it won't have a lot of wrinkles. All right, on to the next color. All right, last up, navy blue. This is a true navy blue. And again, I love the fit of this. Now, there is some fading of color on the collar area. Very slight, but that's to expect to be expected. I've had this for five years. And I, I'm surprised that the whole body of this polo, the color still remains true and the fit still remains true even after five years. So. I don't know how Uniqlo does it, but they cranked out a great, clean product, 30 bucks. All right, guys, that's all I have. Ciao.